Now let's go ahead and maybe turn to something a little frightful. No, not Tayana Edwards. She's just the one that, that finds, <laughs> that does all the dirty work for us. Uh, so we don't have to. Tayana, good to see you. Great to see you, Carly. Thanks for having me. I'm a wimp. I uh, don't shy away from that. I own it. It's okay. <laughs> but I know there's a lot of families that still like to get a, a little scared this time of year. And you found a fun place to do that. Absolutely. And I'm with you on that, Carly. Trust me, I'm not the biggest on the scares, but hey, there's a nice level for everyone with something like this. So the Haunted Road is Central Florida's first drive through Halloween experience. And this is kind of the best of both worlds because during the day, it's a great family friendly event that you could take the kids to. And at night, there are some terrifying frights that just might be great for the holiday season. <laughs> We're getting ready to hit the road. We're headed to Orlando in a 2020 VW Atlas Crossport by Volkswagen of Newport Ritchie. This spacious car has a 5,000 pound towing capacity and a wireless charging spot for your phone. Choose from a fun to drive two liter four cylinder engine or a 3.6 liter V6 engine. We made it to the Haunted Road. During the day, it's a family-friendly event that the kids will love. Well, the Enchanted Road is um, a magical place where non-magicals are visiting. Um, we have Prince Dolt, and he takes the, uh, our guests through this enchanted land where they meet lots of different fun characters, where they sing and dance and they get treats. We have great princes that are so energetic. It's a fun story. I think that they're enjoying the interactive part of it and they have a, hopefully a fantastic time. If you're looking for some more scares, make sure to stick around until after it gets dark for some terrifying thrills. <laughs> the Haunted Road is Central Florida's first drive through Halloween experience. Guests can drive through. They can safely experience Halloween. They will stop at different scenes and watch a story of Rapunzel traveling through a world of disarray. When COVID happened, we didn't want to stop creating. So we started thinking about things we could do that are safe. And that's when we started thinking about things we could do maybe while people were inside a car. So in our show, um, we decided to the safest way to scare people is to only scare them when their cars are parked. Our our show is based on the idea of a haunted house, but we are a theatrical experience, immersive experience, and I think that's what makes us different than a normal haunted house, is that we are giving you drama with scares. All right, can I just say, so again, I'm, an, I'm a wimp. I probably won't go. In fact, I know I won't go, but I think it's a brilliant idea. I'm surprised more of these are not popping up. It's brilliant. I know it's perfect for a time like this because it's completely contactless. It's a theatrical event. It's great, kind of something for the kids to do, especially during the daytime with that, um, you get the treats and kind of deliver yeah. to the car. They get to watch a show. You don't have to come into close contact with people. And in the nighttime, you get scares from your car. And let me tell you, Carly, something about being in your car and having them sneak up <laughs> next to your window was way more terrifying than any haunted house I've ever gone through. See me, I'd probably like, I'd get so scared. I'd like accidentally run people over, like just trying to get out. Like I just, I shouldn't be there. So and a lot of people have said that, but thankfully they decided to be very safe in the sense that they do not scare you unless your car is parked. So you drive scene to scene, you park it okay. in, and that's when they sneak up on you. Cause you know, safety <laughs> reasons, nobody wants to get run over. Nobody wants to have that on their conscience. So <laughs> there's still plenty of time to check it out. There's one more family friendly show this Saturday. And then there are four more uh, nighttime shows to check out this week. Plus, November 5th through 7th, there is an unrestricted haunted road for people 18 and older if you're looking for something extra scary.
Okay, awesome. Tayana, thank you so much for checking in. We always love seeing you. Thanks so much. And if you guys want to see more things to do, uh, check out tasteandseetampabay.com. All right, sounds good. And stay right there. We'll be right back.